morning what's going on look at that malabar spinach yes she's banging it out beautiful absolutely beautiful so yes i grow malabar during the summer because it's usually too hot for regular spinach <coughs> excuse me which bolts on you so i have a red malabar spinach and a green in this bed with nasturtiums which the nasturtiums are trying to take over so we're going to be moving some folks but yeah look at that and then it vines out so i have it tied to this little greenhouse so we can see what it does what's going on with y'all this is my chard bed <clears throat> yeah let me turn the camera so we can see everything the chard is doing fine my peppers <coughs> oh, excuse me all right y'all this is the pepper bed aren't they gorgeous look at them jalapenos yes the jalapenos and then the bell peppers i'm geeked yes i love to see stuff grow <laughs> if you can't tell already all right coming on over here this is our no frills kale which is supposedly made for people who don't like kale. I figure if you don't like kale, what's the point? But anyway, this is my pink celery, which is not doing that great. But she's coming along. I have to trim her up a little bit. Some turnip greens. Yeah. Some stevia. Yep. Some natural sugar. All right. And that's callaloo. Yep. Eat it like spinach. It's growing while doing its thing this over here is some curly kale and some calendula <clears throat> yep curly kale coming right on along calendula's dying out i've been trying to deadhead it and save the flowers but it's a lot going on <laughs> and look at this this is my arugula table isn't it gorgeous y'all <coughs> I don't know what's in my throat, but it needs to go away. Yes, this is my arugula. One of my favorite, favorite lettuces. Yeah. And then over here, some more kale, which is going to be transplanted to the ground. Because if you don't know, once the frost hits that kale, she becomes another beast entirely. Like that deal. So, let's just say we'll be kaling it over here. <laughs> Yeah, I know. Corny. What y'all going? What's going on? What's going on? It's so quiet. It's summertime. I miss y'all in the summer. Look at that red. Them spicy red mustards. Aren't they gorgeous? <coughs> oh, wait. It's not cute. Excuse me, y'all. Some mustard greens, which I'm about to eat some. Some more arugula. And some salad mix down here couple of volunteer tomatoes don't know where they came from oh yeah <clears throat> this is the <clears throat> the madeleine kale <clears throat> <Ooh -wee. clears throat> let me walk over here and drink some coffee maybe that's what i need to do but in the meanwhile Collard greens, sorrel, mm, the chives are blooming. Those are my garlic chives, which are awesome. Look at my golden sage. Isn't it pretty? Some oregano, and some more sage. Onions. Look at that solar flare lettuce. Mistress Maimona, you have red lettuce now. Mm-hmm. Yes, yes. <clears throat> um, trying to do a little cleanup. These are my African marigolds. As you can see, they're much taller than the regular ones. I love the fact that they're so tall. I just didn't get a chance to move them like I wanted to. The other ones are popping on the other end just slowly. Yeah, let me get some coffee. Look at the comfrey. About to harvest some of that. 
a bomb. Gotta make some some bomb. Look at this basil, guys. Isn't it beautiful? <clears throat> one is a culinary blend basil, and the other one is hmm. What's the other one? I can't remember. But it's pretty. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Look at my beans. <clears throat> Aren't they beautiful? They're huge. I don't know what kind of bean. Well, I know. It's a runner bean. Empress runner bean. I liked it because of the flower. <laughs> the flower is pretty to me. And then we have some zucchini that's taking its time. <clears throat> oh, there we go. Look, the critters got it. My one little, little butternut squash. Well, Lord, maybe they'll let me get one out the bunch. But it's cool. Cut them ugly leaves off. You see, powdery mildew is trying to be in effect. <clears throat> What else? Oh, we got babies. That's why I love letting stuff go to seed. Red Russian gay over days. Yay. Collard greens over there. All I'm about to do is put them boys in one little line. Mm-hmm. So hopefully the next time you see this, it'll all be filled in with the new babies that are popping up. Yeah, so it's going to be a kale kind of winter. Kale leafy greens kind of winter. These are my carrots. <clears throat> Trying to see. I did not thin out, y'all. You're supposed to thin out. I did not. So, ain't no telling what I'm gonna get. I'm gonna need to get my gloves and dig around these boys. But yeah. <clears throat> So I ain't want nothing. I really just wanted to come on and say hi. And show y'all my Malabar spinach. <laughs> yeah. So I'm going to sign off because I've got plenty of work to do today. But I just wanted to check on y'all. Hopefully all is well. Look at all these seeds. I'm going to have red sorrel for days. Yes, these are seeds. So I'm going to clip them off. Put them in a little bag. And then hopefully this winter is a project. Separate them all out. I don't know. We'll see. But I am going to clip them. So I have seeds. I definitely have them coming back. But yeah, I'm kind of pleased everything's working out. Oh, look at my castor bean plant. Something so beautiful. It's poisonous. But it's beautiful. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? And it gets really huge. So I'm going to move her to the ground. <clears throat> but I thought that was so pretty. Yeah. So that's about it, y'all. Watch my finger. Yeah. I'm out of here. Just wanted to say, hey, let you know that somebody does love you and thinking about you today. Yeah, that's me. Peace and hair grease, all that good stuff. Remember, be nice. You never know what people are going through. And right now, anything is possible. And, yeah, remember, plant some lettuce, eat the arugula. Isn't it gorgeous? I love it. <laughs> I'll talk to y'all soon. Love you. Peace.